vile tuliowana tulikuja tukakaa chini tukasema mambo unajua kama kuna kitu moja ufanya watu wakosane ni in laws like for example sister zake wakuje kwangu unaona ndio watarudi na story ho oh, pita anafanyiwa ho oh, wini anafanyia pita hivi ho oh. so tulisema story ya in laws wakuje salamu na warudi na unaona sijaisikia tume ama mother in law ameambiwa wini anafanyia hivi kwa sababu gani tuli cancel hiyo that's some supplies to me hata mimi my sisters ama my brothers zangu they don't come ati wakuje wakae naona ndio wataanza kusema oh mom pita anafanyanga wini hivi na hivi so unaona hapo kama mama ameanza kupewa story mbaya ndio wataanza kunini na ataanza kuchukia huyu akianza kumchukia unajua kama apendi mume wangu itaanza ile mgogoro na hapo ndio utaona tumekosana so tulikuja tuka cancel tukaongea story ya my in-laws tukasema let's avoid them na ime work tears work je tunaelekea kumaliza mwaka hatujawahi kosana tukasikia tumeenda kwa hata kwa best couple sisi hatujawahi fika hapo ni ile mnakosana wawili after 2 to 3 hours msha solve msha rudiana kwa, ma, kwa kwa nini msha rudi tu kwa maisha normal ya kawaida communication na finances and kwa pesa and kwa communication na pesa nitachanganya tu zote pamoja there is one thing our mom when you tell me arusi angetuambia if ni mambo na pesa mama yangu amenitisha pesa ninampenda sana na nitume without her consent hiyo inaletanga shida sana and we have even seen some of the families zimeangushwa juu hiyo when pesa zinahitajika kwetu nyumbani i will let her know and if possible ni yeye atatuma i give her the money zinahitajika kutuma atume huko hata kama ziko na haraka aje nikiwa job ikuwe ni kitu urgent ni kitu aje kuna kitu hizi ngojewa nitampigia simu na nitamwambia nitishwe pesa hizi na hizi na hizi nyumbani should i naweza nafaa kutuma tunaweza discuss kwa simu niambie hapana we have this and this and this we have to do in our, in our family so kama uko nazo unaweza tumia kama nusu for sure nusu itawasaidia watauliza either my elder brother or my smaller younger sister watampigia simu wamuulize na itasaidia hapo and for me nimeona it work in my side because whenever my mom or my dad needs money or even my sister na mpigianga simu ama nakuja na mwambi na mwambia ngoja nikifika nyumbani au come back to you kati nimeona niongea na my wife tunaongea tuna discuss pale nafaa zitumwe na mpea anatuma wakati kwao kuna tajika pesa anakuja tunaongea ananiambia mama yake ama babake anaitisha hivi na hivi na hivi ananipea aidha na mwambia atume ama ninatuma mwenyewe to avoid these things unajua watu mke anaweza sema no umepitisha wazazi wako beyond me umepeleka watu wa kwenu wa kuwe mbele wa kuwe yani ndio wako mbele yangu mm. so in that for finances you have to communicate sana 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 unapatanga kuna wale kama mimi nilikuanga msichana so kuna marafiki nilikuanga na wao wenye hawajaolewa wenye ni wa mabash bash unaona sasa hii nimeolewa so mtu ukishatoka huko inabidi yu. kuna wenye utawakato kwa sababu gani hautakuja umeolewa na unataka kwenda hizo bash mtakosana so you ha- kuna marafiki utakaa na wao na kuna wengine utawatoa kwa sababu gani kwa sababu ya familia yako because kama usipowatoa ina maana familia itaanguka mm-hmm. so you have to cut them off for the sake of your family <coughs> and it has work ime work ju kuna wenye tulikuanga marafiki kama mtu ni rafiki yako hajaolewa ana ana tuseme ana bwana ama ana boma unajua ni mtu utakuja umwambie fulani na fulani kwangu huko hivi na hivi 
So you have to. Kuna watu utawatua kwa maisha yako. Si eti amuta wai ongea tena. But ile ya sana. Tabidu utoe. Kwa hivyo kwa marafiki pia mtu inabidinga ya mewabadilisha marafiki. Kisha ingia kwa familia ulazimu kwa sasa rafiki na watu wako na mafamilia. 